Hi guy, today I show you how to fix Xbox One error code 0Z0E8000F. Method 1, check Xbox Live Service Issue. Xbox Live Services may go down due to no possible reason, but that would cause this error to appear. So you can do nothing but wait for the live status to get back live again. You can check this easily by opening the official Xbox Live status webpage here and check the status under the services topic. It should be green like in the screenshot. If it shows limited or major outage status code then there might be issues with the Xbox Live service. If this happens you have to wait until this issue is resolved by Microsoft. Method 2. Check your network connection and reset it if needed. For check your network connection, press the Xbox One button in your controller. Go to Menu, Settings, All Settings, Network, Network Settings. Click on Test Connection in the Troubleshooter. For reset your network connection, go to Menu, Settings, All Settings, Network, Network Settings, Advanced Settings. Go to Alternate MAC Address option, press Clear. Restart your Xbox console to apply the changes done. Method 3. Sign out and re-login. Sometimes it is simple as logging out and logging in back again. The status goes down and live again, but this sometimes requires a fresh login. So you must press the Xbox button on the controller to turn it on. Then press settings on the left sidebar. Here, you can click on General and then Sign Out. Use the Xbox button once again to restart the console and sign in once again. Method 4. Power Cycle Your Router Turn off the Wi-Fi router and wait until the LED indicator stops blinking. Now, unplug the power cable from the router. Wait for around 5 minutes and then plug back the power cable in. Turn on the router, connect to the Wi-Fi network and check if the Xbox error code 0Z0E8000F has been fixed or not. Method 5. Power cycle your console. Power off the console first. Once the console turn off completely, disconnect the power cable from it. Wait for around 1 minute and reconnect the power cable again. Now, power on the console and check if the problem is resolved or not. Method 6. Reconnect the external hard drive. Make sure to disconnect and reconnect the external hard drive to your Xbox console to check if there is any kind of storage connectivity issue happening or not. Sometimes lose connectivity or drive not detected properly by the system can cause several issues with the game saves, downloads, installs, system updates, etc. If all else fails, the online troubleshooter is the last resort. Run the online Xbox troubleshooter which will help with fixing the Xbox error code. I hope you were able to fix the Xbox One error code 0Z0E8000F with my tutorial. Do let me know your valuable comments in the comments section below.